So I decided that day that I would try to become a writer, right? I, I would just give myself the chance, the, the trance to be a writer. And the moment I did, boom, all sorts of stories started coming, short stories and long stories. And I wrote Bird, I got an agent, got an editor. Bird has been published all around the world in 10 countries. But I knew that the person who needed to hear my voice and my story the most was me. Now, what do I mean by that? I needed to hear my own voice. What I mean is, inside each and every one of you, you have dreams, you have hopes. And that takes the form of a voice inside of you. And this voice doesn't really care about what you eat for breakfast or what you're wearing today, but the voice cares about who you are and who you are becoming. It cares about how you choose your friends and how you treat your enemies and how you put your best foot forward in the world. That's what this voice cares about. Uh, to get there, to the cliff, you need to walk down County Line Road, then turn left onto the unmarked dirt road that curves by the swale that collects water when it rains. Yes? She's very careful and makes note of everything. Yes, thing! She notices tons of things, right? She noticed the unmarked dirt road. Most people don't notice unmarked dirt roads, right? Um, so, there's a footpath about a hundred yards away, one that, if you go early in the morning like I did, would drench you with the juice. Yes? She wakes up early. She wakes up early, yes, she's a morning person. Would drench you with the dew that dangles off the long grasses. Yes? She's a meditative. She's imaginative, ding, yes, thank you. Um, there's a huge granite boulder that sits strong and tall and proud by the cliff, and it watches over the fields and houses and hills in the distance. She likes the rock, especially rocks. Yes, she is attracted to rocks. Not only that, she knows that it's a granite boulder, right? She knows types of rocks. After that, oh, sorry, ding, thank you. Um, after that, the drop off comes suddenly. Oh, where are you going? Mysterious. She's mysterious. Ding, yes. All right, so you see how we have all these, all of this. This is one paragraph, right? And yet we are able to figure out, using our detective skills, how to jam pack her character. And I'm not even talking about her, but I am, right? Point of view. This is her point of view. This is how we know about Jewel.